Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Mass Effect Legendary Edition where we are playing game number three and we have just returned from the Citadel where we caught up with basically the entire crew and now I am in my little room saying hi to Ashley and then also I'm gonna read my emails because I knew it I knew that they would have some emails for me so we'll blow them to hell with us no way we're getting out of this war alive be fun to try though oh gosh wow depressing okay so just so you know for the record I could still kick that Turian diplomat in the gizzer I won't but I could. <laughs> Getting some information. I managed to catch up with a few old contacts. They didn't want to talk, but they did. More later, Miranda. Getting away from work. It was nice to take some time and look at the water again. Thank you, Shepard. Thinking of you. Hey, I'm so happy. That's all. How can the future be so unsure and so bright at the same time? Yours, Caden. <laughs> Ready for duty. Uh, damn, yeah, this ink stings a bit more than usual. Still worth it, though. Rematch. Let me know if you ever want to rematch somewhere less windy. Those tornadoes on the Citadel are brutal. <laughs> Send the bombers. All right, so the bombers are on their way. Thank you, blah, blah, blah. I don't really care. All right, so refugee supplies. Thanks for speaking with the refugees, Commander. Dr. Chalk was. Ah, oh, so good. I love it so much. And I still have to find that last ship on the Normandy somewhere, but low priority. So I'm going to go just talk to everybody again. Maybe there's some more conversations that we could have. If not, no worries. Commander, you flew that Geth fighter out of the Dreadnought? Actually, Legion did the piloting. I was stuck in a storage compartment with my squad. Would have loved more time with that ship. Too bad we sent it to hack its team so quickly. Yep, sorry. They needed it more. You know, so. I just don't get the glory. I really just do not get them. You don't get the who? I didn't even hear what you said. Okay, so I have a feeling that the ship may be on this level. But I don't really know because... I mean, the, the truth is it could be so many places. It's like one tiny ship and I have no idea which ones I actually found. So that's the other problem. So I've now officially looked at this level end and it's not here. Okay, so we are going to be looking for the ship in the other levels. Unless I missed it on the kiosk, but I'm pretty sure I didn't because it's on the side that I had for Mass Effect 2. Maybe it's in there. Oh, you know what? I bet it's in there and we still need to pick up another crew member. That's what it is. Commander. All good, Commander. All right. Yeah, I don't think there's anyone down there. Okay, so we're going to go to the crew deck. And we are going to talk to some people here. Okay, so who do we got? We have, okay, so Liara, Dr. Chakra. Okay, so let's talk to, and eh, maybe just talk to Caden first. <laughs> but the Geth? I certainly could have lived happily without coming face to face with another one of those. Really? But the Geth are cool. We like Legion, remember? Um, I hope that we get to see the crew like talking casually like they did with Liara and Garrus because that was so fun. You always pull through, Commander. We've received the supplies from Tactus. Everything good? Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medijal delivery systems. I've also collated information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Glyn. Okay. Brilliant, brilliant. I will definitely do that with Glyph. Okay, and also want to just talk to the rest of the crew? Tally's a welcome face around here. Or, well, a welcome face behind the helmet, I guess. Do you like her? Does Garrus and, do Tally and Garrus get together? I feel like they do. I don't, because people said it in the comments and now I'm starting to think that maybe they do. Thanks. All right, so here we go. What does this do? Health by 5% heals scars. Ew. Yeah, okay. I don't really have any scars, I don't think. Uh, okay, here we have weapon damage and we have ammo capacity. Weapon damage, ammo capacity. Hmm. I think I'm going to go with weapon damage. There's always like, uh, like thermal clips everywhere, right? So... Okay, Le oh, these are recent purchases by uh, Zaid. <laughs> okay. Feel free to look around. 
Thanks, I just did. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna go and talk to people in the war room. Again, the only thing that this ship needs. Something about possibly meeting you on the Citadel next time you're there, Commander. I think she already did. I think you're you're behind the times. Yeah, she already did, girl. It's okay. Trainer, you have a lot of messages that you uh, need to do and you don't you don't even know where we are in space. It's all good. You know, you just focus on your chess game because I'm going to kick your butt next time. All right, so let's talk to, talk to Tally. All right, so let's just say hi. I haven't heard any news about that Reaper base. Okay. Hopefully they'll give us a target. Talk to you later, Tally. Sure. You know what? I just realized Legion wasn't on the Citadel, but I mean, I'd be shocked if he was, sure, right? Sure. I mean, yeah. We'll talk later. We will remain here. Okay. So now we're ready for the next mission, y'all. I just checked with the crew. We now know we can go to the next mission. And that's going to be exciting. And uh, so I, uh, yeah, what's up? Okay. So I also, like, I, I do want to do Rainock really badly. Um, but I do want to make sure that, like, all these little missions. I'm going to start doing them after we do Renok. And then I also have to do prior Priority Eden Prime. <laughs> and then I'm going to do like all the side missions because they are the most lackluster, I guess. I don't know. Just my personal opinion. I'm sorry if y'all disagree. But yeah, I want to do Renok because I remember this mission. Why can't I move? Okay, let me let me exit orbit again. There we go. I remember this mission as one of my favorite in the game. It was amazing. So we are gonna, yeah, go to Renok and do priority. That's my goal. And that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> so then, yeah, I gotta still do Eden. Eden Prime has been like since the beginning of the game. I still haven't done it. It's so bad. It's so bad. Okay, enter orbit. Shut down guest server. Yeah, okay, I want to do this. Okay, so... Geth Command Hub. Orion Escape. Save the Admirable. <laughs> I don't even know if I want to save him. He's a douche nozzle. Okay, I'll save the Admiral first, I guess. He rolls eyes. Okay, we're obviously taking Tally. And sorry, we're taking Caden. <laughs> yep, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's great for me. <laughs> Uh, I don't really want to change my weaponry. They're fine. They're fine. Confirm. All right. Ooh. Okay. So warp is proven to be a lot better than I thought. Increase force impact radius. Um, let's do damage. Damage this time. Increase damage by 40%. Increase duration by 60. Increase weapon damage taken by. Um, increase power damage taken by target by. 50. Um, I'll do this. Yeah, and then I'm good. And then who do we got here? Oh my gosh, she has so many. How is that possible? Did I not do this already? Impact radius, I think, yeah. I think I did this and I forgot to save it. That's what it was. That's why the last mission was so hard because it didn't have any things. Oh my gosh. That's what it was. Increased recharge speed. Uh, increase damage protection. Sure. Um, increase effect uh, armor against bears. Uh, increase damage. Yeah, let's do this one. All right. So then we have alliance officer. Increase biotic power damage. But yep, that's what I want. And increase squad tech biotic damage. Increase recharge speed of squadment shield by. That's amazing. I'll definitely take that. Okay, and then I think this one. Oh, I'm done with him. Can't. He doesn't have any more. Oh, barrier. Okay. Two, three. There we go. All right, tally. Yeah. See, I told you. Stupid me. I cannot believe I did not upgrade her properly. So what happened was. Um, we started it, the cinematic, and I saw she had this really ugly gun. <laughs> so I had to like restart it and go back and I forgot to actually do this part. Wow, that's so depressing. And this was like on the Geth, um, that the ship. And I was like, man, this is so hard. But yeah, because they didn't have any things. Stupid, I'm so stupid. Uh, okay, so increase health and shield, uh, re recharge speed. I think like health and shield 
Weapon damage, power damage by... Sure, yeah. And then increase recharge speed of squad mates tech powers. Yeah, I like that. Uh, increase, uh, yeah, that's what I like. And then we're gonna do combat drone. We'll do increase, yep. And then we'll do you. Increase attack range duration. This one, yep. And then sabotage. Power damage by 50%. Damage taken by 30% when enemy weapons are overheat. I don't really know what that does, but we'll just we'll just do this. Yeah. Okay, there we go. So she is done now. Commander Shepard, this is Admiral Zen. Have you reached Salkaris' escape pod? Not yet. What's your status? The civilian fleet has taken significant losses since Salkaris sacrificed his ship to destroy a Geth ground cannon. Searching for their lost admiral is the only thing keeping the captains from panicking. What makes finding the admiral a priority? Despite opposing the invasion, he did an admirable job protecting our civilian ships. Without him, some of our non-combatants are planning to leave the flotilla. Picture the consequences, if you will. They've lost a leader in a war they didn't want. Their wants are immaterial. We are committed. Even Zalkoris understood the civilian fleet's importance. The invasion would be stalled without a supply chain, after all. I'll do what I can. Keep your civilians safe. I make no promises. My own ships must be coordinated for our final strike on Radok. I'm getting some static. It appears Alcoris crashed within range of a Geth jamming tower. You must disable it to contact you. Make sure to proceed with caution. Zen? Admiral Zen? It's been a long time since Admiral Koris left a spaceship. Let's hope he's all right. We'll see you in a minute. Take us in to the tower. I don't like Admiral Zen. We're taking fire. The Geth installed anti-aircraft guns beside the jamming tower. We'll have to disable them on foot. Once the guns are gone, you take out the tower. Right, Commander. Setting you down here. Is this their home world? My people have been in exile for centuries. To be standing here in the land of my ancestors. So cool, right, Tally? All right, this is. Yeah, just keep coming, like, well, machines. Were you around when the Alliance claimed that we'd wiped out the last major Geth outposts? Yeah, Intel was always a little underfunded. This is so freaking cool. So I gotta save. What the heck is that? Is that is that a guy? He's yellow. There we got some drones. That's why she couldn't use the drones. I was wondering where her the hell her drones were. Oh, this makes so much more sense. When I refilm this, I have to make sure that I actually do it properly. Is there anything over here? Oh, yeah. Credits. You know me. I'm a little like I don't even know. I looked at all the guns. I don't even think I want to upgrade the guns. Do I really need credits at this point? No. But maybe, I don't know. Wait, what do I Oh, what's this? Wreckage credits again? Oh, yeah. Where am I going? Okay. OMG. Continue. I'm okay. Watch out for more mines. You see Caden's worry for me. Shepard! It's a Geth patrol. On. Oh, I'm supposed to go. Oh, over there. I see. Okay. Okay. Let's go this way. Let's get closer. Oh, 
Oh. These attack and, and defense drones are epic. I love Tally's attack drones. Fatiga. Nothing is faster than Jatiga's something Voss pause. That's what I thought she said, but it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> All right, but maybe it's like a like a Korean language, or maybe I'm not even hearing it properly, and maybe it would help if I had subtitles. Just saying. Um, yeah, but I don't play with subtitles. All right, let's see. There, anti-aircraft guns. Okay, let's do this. That was a beautiful way to start. All right. Whoops. I meant to get behind that. Got him. Credits. Oh shoot, there's more? Bye. Check out the control panel on the AA gun. All right, sounds good. I will, as soon as I take a look around, you know, for my supplies. Uh, have we got anything up here? Oh my God. One of us needs to take those AA guns offline. Oh, I didn't realize I was leaving the area. <laughs> uh, I think that Tally would be better. You take the guns. She's the tech no expert. Problem. All right. Yep. Yeah. Be careful. All right, hold on, where's my... to throw those again. Shoot. Oh, I need warp. Warp, 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 warp. Warp, yes, warp. That's the one. I forgot. Warp is... Okay, hold on. Warp needs to replace that. That's right. Good. Now let's shut down the two by the tower. You are so impressive. All right, let's do warp again. Oh. Oh yeah, that's a really good one. Why have I never used it before this game? I don't understand. It's impressive. Look at that. Look at that. I think it's like extra impressive on Geth or something. Like on AIs. So, Edie, you watch out. Don't. Oh my god. Proximity mine again. I suck at that. I'm really bad. Okay, so let's go over here. And also, I want to save. Thank you. All right. Okay, I think we can proceed. There we go. We got, oh, there's some more proximity mines here. Be careful, y'all. Oh, shoot, Kaden got in it. Huh. <laughs> it's okay, I've already done it twice, Kaden. <laughs> No more embarrassing than it was me. <laughs> All right. I'm not sure if we're going to need to use this money later. That's why I want to get Shepard, it all. We found someone. Oh. Well, let me save. <laughs> you. 
You heard my message. <laughs> Send out a distress call. Radios are down. You a soldier? Maintenance. Darn hats. I... Uh, I clean engine parts. This place is filled with geth. You should have hidden. I saw I could buy the other civilians time. Fight some geth. There were so many. First time I've even held a gun. Don't move. We've got Medigil. Look for the Admiral. Destroy that jamming tower, and you can radio him. We'll find him, Dorn. I promise. Please, listen. The civilian fleet didn't want this war. If there's even a chance that Admiral Gorus can get us out alive, and my son, tell him. Tell Jonah that his father made it to the home world. We will. Rest well, Dorn has the Vassaranok. Let's get to that tower. That was very sad. I was very, very sad. <laughs> Oops. I hope we didn't give away our, our, our position. Oh yeah. There they are. All right. Tally's got the same idea as me. All right, so I'm gonna do a warp. Okay, they are super effective. I'm gonna go with a, this. How do I get them out of here? Oh, wow. You suck. <laughs> I'm more concerned about that gun. I don't even think I'm doing any damage on it. What am I supposed to do? Can I go around this way? Caden's got the right idea. I got Caden. Oh wow, the turret's still on me. Should activate turret. Well, where is the guns console? It would help if I knew. Ah, there it is. All right, so I'm gonna need to use that AA gun for sure. In a second. All right. What do you want with a gun? Uh, I think I'll I'll choose. Uh, I'll choose. Tally again. I want you on this tally. Right. Yeah, come on, Caden. Shepard, you should be able to use the Geth turret. Yep, I will. More Geth. Where? Oh yeah. <laughs> Bitch, no. We just officially declared our relationship. <laughs> I could have used the AI again still. Warp, 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 warp. Yeah, bye. 
Oh, shoot. No, no, no. I can't move. It wouldn't let me move. I wasn't just being stupid. Ah, oh, okay, that, that was dumb. All right, let me use this turret. Okay. Who should disable the gun, Shepard? Okay, let's do Caden this time. Yeah, gun line, Caden. I'm on it. I wanted you to feel special too. <laughs> but I really would pick Tally, but... He's good to, though, technically, he's good too. Yeah, see, Tally's faster. Oh, he's fast too. I'll signal the shuttle. They're both tech experts, that's why. took up arms for this insanity. It's too late for us. It's only too late if you die down here. You can't possibly think you can stop this war. I don't know. What I do know is that I can't do it without your help. Ancestors, forgive me. Uploading my coordinates. We're coming. The Admiral's out to the I've got this. I have to reload. Death behind you. Get in cover. This is really hard because it's so much kickback. Can't even see where I'm shooting. Gonna come back on us. Right, go, 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 quick. My crew. Perhaps there's still time. Hello. This is Zell Chorus. Does anyone copy? Hello. We've got to go. I pray they found comfort in the homeworld skies. <laughs> Commander, unrest has spread further than I thought. You were right that I return. Have you talked the civilian captains into staying? Yes, they've regrouped into defensive positions around the fleet's core. If we hadn't stopped them from... 
Any aid I can offer is yours. After the Quarians drove the Geth straight into the Reaper's arms, I'd give anything to stop the madness of this war. And that's why your people needed you back? Of course. It's time we turned our attentions to those we can still save. Farewell, Shepard. Fly safely. Commander, we've located the Reaper base, transmitting the local signal. Good. And not a moment too soon. With the Reaper code upgrades, the Geth are tearing the fleet apart. Once the signal is disabled, the Geth will pose no threat to Creator forces. You sound conflicted. While the old machines have unethical purposes, their upgrades have vastly improved our people. Observe. A Geth processing signal. A single unit, I believe. Correct. Now, ten nearby units networked cooperatively. Now, a single Geth unit with the old machine upgrades. That's a fully evolved AI. Yes. We do not agree with the goals of the old machines, but we find this growth... beautiful. Indicative of life. It is. Commander! Come on, Admiral. That's a living creature, no matter what platform it's running on. And they will die when we destroy the base. They allied with the Reapers. To save themselves from you. Maybe they don't have to die. Just because this one appears friendly. Well, it hasn't fired on a ship with me aboard it. Commander, are you suggesting... I'm not suggesting anything. All I'm saying is, maybe they don't all have to die. It's a moot point until we take out that base. The surrounding area is heavily fortified, and they have placed jamming towers to prevent orbital targeting. Sounds like we're going in on foot. Admiral Zen developed a laser guidance system that can cut through the jamming. It's synced to the Normandy's targeting computer. So the Normandy launches a precision strike at whatever target I have painted? That ought to do it. Edie, this work for you? Yes, it should enable us to make a precision strike against the Reapers. And anything else in our way? The Geth will quickly reconfigure their jamming towers to neutralize this technology. You should not use it before reaching the base. I've sent the coordinates for the Reaper base. Are we clear to go? That Geth fighter squadron is still tearing through the fleet. Can you hold out? If that fighter squadron isn't taken out, a lot of our ships won't make it. But we'll do what we can. This is your operation, Commander. If you want to strike now, you've got my support. I gave in to your reckless behavior before, Han. The Potter fleet isn't moving. We need to break their flanking attempt to buy our frigate's time to make repairs. And then you'll charge off again, like last time. This is different, Ron. Unless we give our ships time to rest, we're gonna lose them. So pull them back. If I withdraw now, the Geth will flank us, and we'll lose any room to maneuver. I need the patrol fleet. I gave in to Throwing more ships into that mess just puts more lives at risk, Admiral Garrel. Fine. I'll pull back the heavy fleet. And when we're taking fire from both sides, those deaths are on your heads. Thank you, Commander. It's difficult to keep him in line. You're welcome. Um, and also, I will say this. So first of all, that was a great mission. The other thing is we still have another mission to do on Renuk before we can do the official major mission, which is Renuk. <laughs> um, we have to do the one that is the yeah the geth fighter one and then we'll do the main priority one so what i'm going to do is i'm going to wrap this part up here because in the next part what we're going to do is we are going to talk to the crew do the other renek mission and then we are going to be able to go to the priority mission and then after the renek priority mission i plan on doing the eden prime priority mission so we have some lots of priority missions coming up i'm very excited and i will talk to you guys and see you in the next part thanks for watching and bye for now